we used to not work out, right, for like six months, then go work out one day and then go take click clicks and be like, yeah, nigga. Why would and, you, and it used to work. In jail, you got to work out. What the fuck else are you Nah, doing? we were smoking weed and fucking gambling. And, oh, that sounds fun too. But. Yeah, jail used to be fun, bro. Don't let nobody lie to you. Like, <laughs> if you, if you, if, if you you're not true, getting terrorized and beat up on and shit, like if you, you have got, a bit of status, I can see it being all right. You got control over that though. Like, you, it's just like the music industry. It could be as but how long were you in there? Me, I was in there off and on for like eleven years. You weren't in there long enough to feel like you had to fuck the homie in the ass. Nah, see, <laughs> that's like you weren't you weren't in there long, long enough to I really feel it. I was in there it. long enough to <laughs> want to help the homie that the nigga trying to fucking ass. See, now you overwork. I him. almost got in a problem in a maximum prison for standing because, up for the punks. No, for standing up against. So standing up to a punk that was trying to rape a nigga that wasn't a punk. Oh, shit. Like, so a punk? I thought punk was just the dude who was getting raped. Oh, well, the butt booty bandit. Okay. <laughs> I stood up against Freaky Black. <laughs> you protected one of your homies from getting... No, not one of my homies. A young kid. Like, I'm in yeah. a max prison, right? I'm yeah. like 16, 17, 18, like these years, right? Kid. And another nigga come up that's young. And I see a nigga trying to... Do something, something. And I, I was offended by it. Like, even though it ain't have nothing to do with me. You fucking the vibes up. Like, I don't know why you just looked at that man like he was licorice. Like, this is our house. Yeah. Like, you can't be stealing a booty in our house. A, and it's not even a nigga who want that. Like, I would be offended. There's niggas in here who wants that. Like, go holla at them. Do you that know in another jail. Go holla. It's niggas in every jail that's wants that. I would hope that if I got locked up, I would have that kind of seniority that I could outlaw fucking other dudes in the ass against their will. You can. Now, but if you I want couldn't, to, I couldn't stop if, nothing. If it's consensual, that go ahead. That nigga was ready to kill me. That nigga's like, nigga, I got life, nigga. You don't, do I tell you when to get your dick wet, nigga? <sighs> So you I was like, oh, stop nah, it? I respect it. Nah, fuck no. <laughs> <laughs> he, <gave up. laughs> he was ready to die, and I wasn't. All right, Straight sorry, up. buddy. How I, I tried you? to stand up to you. <laughs> I ain't last long, nigga. How long you was in Rikers? I was on Rikers Island off and on for a couple of years, but... I ain't trying to rock, rock I, the boat I, that hard. I, I, like, this was in prison. No, Rikers, that oh, wasn't... Right. I, I, I seen it's in on Rikers, but... They never was like around me because there's a, a house where they put those type of people that's away from us. You understand? So we never really got to see him really until you get up north where they just throw everybody in the dorm together. There's remember no cells. When, remember when Wayne was in Rikers? Right? You wasn't in uh, at Rikers when Wayne was in there. Nah. Mm -mm. You said you was locked up with China Mac though, right? Yeah. I was on. I was not on Rikers. I was already upstate. I think. China Mac what stepping on shit. gun charge? Like 07, 08. What was China Mac like 09? behind bars? We need to know. China Mac, he was he was, holding he was, it down. He was the same way. He All was right. about his money, he was about his business, and he'll defend himself Good. if a nigga wanna play with him. Like right. I don't see nothing really different besides him being more playful. Hmm. Like before he being had the around, chip tooth then? I'm I think so. Was, I think I think that's China where he Mac. chipped it. I think that's China where Mac. he chipped it okay. in jail. But this the thing. You gotta understand, being around China Mac and them niggas. At a time, it was like him and a whole bunch of niggas like him with mad money, and it was like the fucking Chinese fucking mafia to us. Like oh, Shadow, that was the name of his, his gang. gang. Yeah, like them niggas was like real get money niggas. That you know, if they gotta get in that bullshit, they would. You know what I'm saying? But for the most part, being around China Mac, it was like I don't know, bro. Like I was around a. Japanese royalty or some shit. Chinese, but Chinese, yeah, my fault, bro. Yeah, but it's like in his name. You feel me? Like <laughs> it's easy to remember. <laughs> <laughs> but bro, like being around him and like Yaya Flawless and like it was like a team called COD, right? There was some fucking Asian niggas that was paid, and they was running around doing what they want to do in the music industry. And I think that was China Mac managers or something. But I was cool with them. Like, they started a clothing line. I used to wear their shit, you know? I want to like ask that. you about the most feared GD rapper out the rack. The most feared GD rapper you talking about? A-O-K-D. 
How you feel about AOKD? You said that he's the <laughs> most feared rapper. You he GD rapper. He's GD. He used to be. I, I think he left that behind. I don't think the GDs accept you if I, you sleep in a tent. I, nah. Should nah. I just accept that I was being trolled with all that? Because I kind of like, <laughs> I kind of like went along with it, like a little bit long. Wait, nah. I don't think. I don't like, want people to think I'm stupid. I'm really listen, falling for it, right? A, a, listen, I, wait, Why you put a, a, he put an Adam Twenty Two diss on World Star. He don't even How say. Did he do that. He doesn't even say anything about me in the songs. It's, it's just a song. He just put Alan 22 <laughs> disc in the title. I listened to it last night. He does not say one word about me. <laughs> he didn't say nothing. And it's on World Star. It got like 15,000 views. All right. So look, I'm sorry. Right? Honestly, how I feel about AOKD, right? I feel like it's room for everybody in the world, man. You know what I'm saying? No matter what kind of dude you are or what kind of shit you into, if you're funny, you funny, man. Whether it's you at your worst or you at your best or you stunting or you fronting. Mm. A funny dude is a funny dude, man. But that he, nigga's funny. I ain't like, gonna lie. His playbook if right he now. he really was mad and he really like got himself kicked out and really was doing all of that, like I think he was doing that to get his girlfriend back. Can we confirm that the breakup with the girl was fake? I don't think so. I think he did that to get the girl back. I think I he think because Lil Marcus, he, even even the chain snatching was a skit, right? Yeah, that's that's what I was starting skit. to gather from because because that's what AOKD said in the comments on the Lil Marcus thing. So, so like, let me ask you a question. So did say Savage get the chain back? So you think he's? In I on think they're f- around. You think he's in on it too? You think Tay Savage down is down for the memes? He's just having fun with it too, right? You think so? I mean, yeah. Went for BJ Main is game to the do skits and shit. But huh? they talking about real shit though. I, I never really like all talking this, about fake shit. Too. I heard I heard his chain got really took. <laughs> what's, the, I, what's, I the, what's the fake shit? The chain snatching and the becoming homeless and the living in a tent. No, I think you're talking about in the Savage puddle. and Jay May. Well, I think, but you're saying that Tay Savage had the chain because he did post it, right? Was that, yeah, I think yeah. he got it back for him. I think that that was Cap too, right? I don't know. I think maybe he got it back. He gave it to Jay May. Jay May gave it back to him. I think okay. at one point somebody told AOKD that. All publicity is good publicity. And he's just been like, oh, okay, so all I have to do is pretend <laughs> that bad things happen to me and then people will talk about me. <laughs> so, the FYB Jay effect. I feel like Jay Main got all these niggas on the internet. But over they didn't see any from the over. nine just <laughs> huh? skinny from the nine went homeless too. But I mean he was doing that in like a five hundred dollar Montclair jacket or some shit, right? I don't know how much that shit is. It might be like 800 I don't know. That shit is expensive as fuck. So that's not very convincing because wouldn't wait, you up. sell the Montclair jacket? Wait, all right, so let me ask you a You'd be able to live off the Montclair wait, coat for wait, fucking wait, wait, a week up. and a half. Hold up. Hold up, right? <laughs> One second, please. Please. So, so you think that when I got evicted and I was working, you think that was fake too? <laughs> when did that happen? See? You didn't even see it. I, I, don't, I don't think it was fake. I seen it. It's not about it happening. It's about you documenting it. 